Brought to you by GTA, your island, your network. Chief Judge Francis Tedinko Gatewood didn't want to continue with sentencing a Guam Army National Guard specialist on Tuesday afternoon. Quote, I'm concerned about the circumstances of this case, end quote. As we've been reporting, Danielle Calvo entered a plea agreement with the feds, admitting to racking up more than $14,000 in recruitment bonuses she was not entitled to between 2010 and 2011. The bonuses were part of the Guard Recruiting Assistance Program, also known as GRAP. Although Prosecutor Mayor Vic David recommended no jail time, only probation, noting the defendant's cooperation. The chief judge was alarmed by parts of the pre-sentence report that stated Calvo was threatened by a higher-ranking officer who had a reputation of being sexually aggressive. That officer allegedly told her what details to put in to receive the recruitment bonuses. He'd also demand a cut. Parties did not disclose the individual's name, only that he may still be under investigation and has yet to be indicted. According to defense attorney Jay Ariola, the man has since been discharged from the guard as a result of a sexual harassment case and may no longer be on island. Quote, I don't get moved that often, end quote, the chief judge noted and requested more information from Calvo's therapist. She's been seeing as a result of the federal case. The court noted Calvo is a single mother and still employed with the guard. Cavill still has a portion of the funds she obtained through the GRAP program and has agreed to pay back the restitution in full. Cavill is scheduled to appear back in court for a continued sentencing hearing on October 27. Reporting for Guam's News Network, I'm Crystal Paco. Brought to you by GTA, your island, your network.